Hello YouTube, um, so I've been away um, from YouTube uploading wise uh, for a little while and there's a lot to explain um, because I still have more than more than 200 videos started and such easily so um, it feels as though I've been talking to you because I have in that sense been making new videos where I've been uh, doing the various things, comedy, serious campaigns that because they have not been uploaded you've not you're not aware that they exist of course so from my end I've been talking to you but from your end you have not heard from me so I've been making many updates updates about updates and stuff but I still have not got round to uploading so many yet um I will hopefully uh, have that sorted soon when things are things are getting calm again and I'll be able to explain in the next videos uh, in the next few videos um, again depending on when they get uploaded so things may happen in a funny order but anyway um, uh, the things are get things will be coming um, linear again still spontaneous but it's good to be spontaneous so there's that good elements like now um, this will probably be a short video so it'll be easier to um, uh, edit process, you know, less intensive for the, lap the laptop and to upload um, uh, on board brand. Um, so, um, so this will be a quick video, and then more will keep following. So this may be the first you'll see in a while. But um, I know there's an IGN watermark, so you can see where the um, uh, up uh, the whoever uploaded this video got it from. I just um, um, sneakily, you know download it just to make it easier for me to um uh, record in case the browser's going funny or something i don't know um but anyway uh, so um so yeah i saw it first i think late last night but it may have been morning time you know um um i was still catching up on sleep because i had long coach journeys i was drifting off and as i did saw um uh Hang on, let me get this the right way around. I think I saw a short extended trailer last night. I think that's right. Or oh, morning, whatever time. But, you know, from my perspective, as my day was ending um, and I was falling to sleep, I might have even fallen asleep already and woken up, for, you know, before falling asleep again. Um, uh, but, and then I saw the English dub at first this morning. And then I fell asleep again and then watched it a few times, you know. Uh, morning afternoons. It's now one o three p.m. It's the twentieth of July, two thousand and eighteen. Twentieth of July, two thousand and eighteen. Tomorrow is the twenty-first, which means a month until my birthday. Um. So anyway, it's one o four p.m. now. Um. So morning afternoon time. But maybe I did. I can't remember it. Were there? Was there too extended? I. Yeah, I think there was. I think I saw a. Um, you know, I was going to. I was opening a new tab, and the news suggested news came, and it said. Um, uh, I think it said, um, check out Broly fighting or something like that. Check out Broly fighting. Um, so we saw that briefly. Him like punching Goku or the, their fists meeting. I mean, again, I, I was very tired. So I'm maybe imagining this. We'll need to go over to see whether or not I made this up. Maybe I dreamt of this. Um, but um, I did dream about Vegeta like a few days ago. Funnily enough, I think. Um, uh, but um, and he might have been about the movie. Interestingly, um, uh, I um, he um, he. Um, uh, so they said, "Oh, meet meet Broly and um, uh, meet Broly." Let me just check it. Still recording my voice, yeah, because I'm doing it on the Microsoft's voice recording app. I don't have the greatest faith in that application um, on Microsoft in general. So I'm just just checking. Uh, so I clicked on that, and then I think it was today I woke up or late last night, morning, whatever, and I'd read straight to. I thought, oh, hang on, is this fan made? Well, wow, already the English dub there with me. Well, that's really good. So if they've been busy, they've done the English dub, or at least some of it, or at least maybe the final product will be slightly different. But yeah. Yeah, they've um, they've um, so I was well, wow, okay, English. <laughs> we jump from uh, another trailer about uh, Japanese, um, you know, just well, visuals could be in any dub, I guess, but you know, um, and then um, then we've got English stuff steady on. So and it's and it's more words um, from the English crew than we've seen from the Japanese, at least for me. Um, so so that's all um, kicking off. So that's good. Um, and I, I and they said Funimation's so obviously that's how well you know more American based in. English UK 
um, England based but um, you know obviously we get to their dub as well more directly than we do the Japanese but um, yeah so that's good I really hope it comes to cinemas that would be good I'd never managed to see the others and Resurrection F and um, Battle of Gods at the cinema but it would be really good if um, I think they usually do, do select cinema so I really hope it comes to Birmingham I, I really really and obviously if you live elsewhere then I hope for you that you get to see it um, but yeah I really hope it comes we've got an Odeon cinema I think it's Odeon on the high street Birmingham's a big place plenty of cinemas to go around so I really hope it does come um, maybe we could organise a meet up on Facebook or something. Oh, and I want I should dress up. I should dress up in my Vegeta costume if I do get to go. <laughs> we, we like it. Yeah, you're watching my new movie. Um, uh, has anyone ever cosplayed or whatever as Brolix? I'm not sure. I mean, some must have done, I'm sure, and I've seen images I must have done, but um, so they came to mind. I've not really seen like any of these classic pendants, necklaces, or anything. Again, if you haven't um, guessed by my accent, I live in England, I live in Birmingham, so if you're in America, um, your time zone is going to be confusing. So when, I mean, are you even awake now in America? I mean, I don't know when this will be uploaded. Whoops, I just clicked into Zoom. Well, no, it doesn't look Zoomed. Um, uh, I said Zoom double mode or something. But anyway, whenever this gets uploaded, I don't know if you'll be awake, but um, my time, you know, I'm GMT, GMT, yeah. So we've got the sound. Of Re so Reese starts off, and you hear. Let's turn that up a bit. So um, Reese is um, uh, basically saying, as you just heard, um, so Goku, you see, given more strength than you have already. Where have you been, Reese? <laughs> no, but it's a good introduction. And obviously, with movies, they have to be careful because um, there's, you know, a very um, innocent. Um, and the standing to want to make what they call approachable for everybody that they fear some people you know something's too heavy they will they'll be turned off so people as in other words people don't follow the franchise and you know if they start going about tournament of power what on earth are you on about but at the same time it can obviously act it oh let's get new people and let's get them looking at the series keep the dvd sales up so there's all sorts of different things to, to consider but as you were here goku actually mentions the tournament of power straight away and um, another feeling this probably does take place very early on in the movie, I'm, you know, I'm pretty sure. And a tournament of power opened my eyes. No way I can stay at the same level I'm at now. So I love the American accent tournament. I oh, was it um go one of Gohan's older Funimation voices on the Budokai games. It's just the two really um hard and it's really um it's just so striking how different it is to the to. I mean, obviously there's more than one English accent, British accent, etc. But um how we tend to say it. I just can't emulate how they say tournament, tournament. I'm fired up. Oh, that looks like a capsule corporation and thing. Now, if I'm not mistaken, Bourne was up to, I know they did mention it taking place in different time zones. If I'm not mistaken, there's time travel involved. But I don't know if that means Broly's in the past. Maybe they're going to make out he was the original Super Saiyan God. I know, but that doesn't make, oh, we'll see. We'll see anyway. There's Beerus. There you go. So, um,. Uh, how do I go back just a few scenes? I'm not sure how you do it on VLC. Well, oh no, that's the beginning. No, no, you're not the beginning, you sausage. You silly sausage. Okay. Oh. It's, oh, may, maybe, maybe I'm reading this entirely wrong because you remember she sent Goku to the middle of the earth to get something. So maybe, but maybe Bomb was not involved in the time machine because that would explain why like, Beerus was looking displeased. But um, maybe he's just hungry. Um, no, I'm... Um, Okay, so I think Bulma, I mean, could be some sort of like protective suit, different coloured from I think the one she had Goku don. But anyway, um, I mean, it's clearly Bulma, just slightly different artistic style and stuff. But um, um, the flare side, this is Bulma, green haired, um, short, sort, sort of short looking, I guess. Um, this is definitely Bulma. We're sure um, an interesting sort of, no doubt, capsule corporation um, uh, created a uh, suit. But why is she wearing it? I mean, that's a big clue. So is it to, to do with time travel? Is it the center of the earth? I don't think so. Unless she's trying to go back in time and Broly somehow comes to the future. I don't know. I don't think Samasu and the time wings are going to be part. <laughs> Imagine if Samasu met Broly. <laughs> that, that would be interesting. And Samasu's first and only line would be, so you share the same. Uh, well, actually, it would be to... Um, actually, if he said it to Vegeta, that would be funny. If he said it to... Um, uh, 
if you just said it to Broly, said to Broly, so you share the same obsess obsession with Goku as I do, that would be quite um, funny. But um, so I wonder, yeah, I wonder if they're going to keep in the endless, um, incessant um, air bellowing of Kakarot. And um, what is interesting here, like in um, um, Bio Broly and. Um, uh, Broly returns. We have Go uh, Goten and Trunks at <laughs> similar ages. Um, uh, so that helps try the kids that that's never grew up. Um, so that that would be interesting. Um, in their, well, we haven't actually seen them. Maybe they've grown up now. This does take place after the tournament of power, but we shall see. I have a feeling they're going to be kids still. Um, so the, so this is Bulma. Uh, what is she doing? Why is she wearing that suit? Um, did they travel back in time, or is it just because of this volcanic area and she insisted on coming along? She, you know, she's a go-getter, an adventurer. Um, she does not like to be left behind. So there's, you know, um, obviously instantly thinking of Freezer, um, and is this person working for Freezer? Probably a lackey of some sort, but in, in which time period? And there's some funny onion head, it's got an onion head, was he an onion head? Oh, here we have classic Scousers, I'm not sure if I noticed that the first time, because it went by so quickly. Interesting sort of mushroom... Uh, not really, well, sort of mushroomy, um, oh, what do they remind Almost squid, decayed squid-like, um, settlements or, um, some kind of protrusions. Oh, well, we know whose ship that is, that we're pretty sure. Whom nobody knows. A Saiyan whom nobody knows, except everybody who's seen the previous movies. But it's, in, as you'll see, there's no doubt some other things have been changed beyond aesthetics, but, um, uh, you, you'll see, um, Pegasus looks old. He's, he's had a bit of a redrawn, whereas, um, Broly looks quite similar. So we've got this, um, so, what's that? S A B and um can't read for Jesus, but um they're all chilling out uh, in one sense anyway. Their regular clothing underneath. There he is. I, I don't know who he is, but his energy's absurd. So as you can see, very similar looking, um obviously a slightly different art style in general here, but um very prominent looking into and the Dragon Balls, how are they going to be involved? There you go, there's Pegasus. Now, now notice the damaged eye again, that's very interesting. Um, and now, again, Rich, um, I mean, does he get revived by somebody? If so, who? Is Goku really silly enough to um, cause this trouble? Or, um, I don't know, did he or did he somehow survive? Did he, Well, how are they going with the story? How does he relate to King Vegeta? I hope King Vegeta gets an expansion here. I mean, he might, he must get at least a passing reference. I'd be very surprised if he doesn't, but um, hoping for the more than a passing reference. Of flight. It'd be good if he actually featured directly, but I'm being careful not to get too excited about that prospect, but that would be good. He looks got like an interesting sort of um, dress wear, pink dress flowing underneath, and he has like some in a pinkish garment. Um, yes, yeah, so notice he's, he's like General Martok from Deep Space Nine. He's got the he's got the gash, the scar, and the um, damaged eye. Um, so yeah, uh, he was was he completely black or black or brown? His um, beard and all of his um, visible hair. The really. uh, f face is quite different as in general, um, and voice as well. Um, Hairline, interesting. Oh, oh, kind of more. Uh, well, actually, kind of more a Vegeta like his hairstyle. Um, oh, he almost looks. The more I look at him, he look, reminds me of a great ape, as in in the um, Dragon Ball universe, the great apes. I can just see him transforming into great ape. And on that note, does he have his tail? I wonder. Would would he transform? <laughs> Imagine Broly transforming into great ape. <laughs> the end of civilizations everywhere. Um, they they should do that. Um. Uh, or maybe this is his alternate, maybe they link to that, somehow he doesn't, you know, this is an alternate, he can't transform into Nate, he, the, the energy can't, add for some reason, um, is unsustainable, so he has to transform with this green aura. Um, yes, he's got, he's got, he's commanding an army of some, so his freezer trying to um, recruit him or what? Sounds like multiple voices are there, they all nice um, graphics there. Probably. Vegeta's got his guard up. There he goes, Super Saiyan. Super Saiyan 2. Um, 
I guess it depends what style they got. I mean, I'm tempted to say Super Saiyan 2, but um, let's all let's put some of these in trouble there. Oh, right, now we've got, as you can see, very um, very appropriate for the winch, wintry um, environment. Very, um, oh, I can't think what it's reminiscent of, but yeah, um, very, very, um, very appropriate clothing. But then, um, why, why are this, um, this, um, this setting, I wonder how precisely this ties in and what planet is this on? The prodigy. Here comes Freezer's introduction. Now Goku was his body. And then we've got uh, obviously classic red god mode. Um, you've not seen Vegeta. Actually, no. I think we do go into blue soon, but um, no doubt that, that would have feature anyway. Um, as for Broly, we know all about his transformations, and it seems they're going to be kept quite similar yeah, in places and ways. He was almost bursting out of a green or white himself. Then, Saiyan warrior race. Now whose hand was that? Was that Broly as a child um, reaching out to Pegasus maybe? I wonder if they're going to keep in a story about King Vegeta holding his execution. <laughs> be for, for one, even though that wasn't Vegeta himself, for once Vegeta would be getting an ear for not um, Goku. They'd be saying, oh Vegeta, your father, your father caused all this mess, now he's seeking revenge. <laughs> that has got, that's going to be Vegeta's, um, he's going to be receiving a verbal bash for this time round. Okay, that's not good. Something's exploding for someone. Now, it almost looked like a test tube of... Well, was it, I think? Uh, test. And we've got, with the Saiyan, a very long tail, almost Kaba looking like. That's surely Pegasus fleeing. So, look, yeah, it looks like they were um, thrown out somewhere. There we go. There's Broly one last time. The story of an unknown Saiyan. Maybe the original Super Saiyan God will come to help them fight him. That would be good. I'm sorry. So that was just a quick introduction. <laughs> I suddenly, <laughs> I wasn't visually recording my, um, you know, me pausing. So it doesn't really make sense me talking about um, oh um. I'm just pausing too much or not enough and copyright issues because I haven't even recorded any uh, visual only the audio um, may be caught up alongside me talking so um, so maybe I'll just insert some Im images to go alongside but anyway um, let me know what you think because this sounds very exciting and um, we've got a while to go on to it and um, releases but um, we're, we're getting more information I guess sooner than I expected so this is all good English dub even to boot so um that's all very good. Um, and yeah, like I said, I'll be uploading some more videos as soon as I can.